FBI investigators are trying to track down the bomber who attacked the Atlanta Olympics, but they have little to go on. Just two short, shaky handheld videos recorded by tourists at the scene before the disaster, but its equipment just can't handle the poor image quality. Investigators contact NASA astrophysicist David Hathaway. He's a solar astronomer who has spent 30 years using technology to improve images of solar activity on the sun. People died here, and so we thought this was our chance to help justice be served. The poor quality of the shaky footage pushes even NASA's technology to the limit. We had 13 seconds of video, 400 frames, of very dark, noisy, grainy video. They enhance the image quality by isolating each frame. Then they transform the 400 frames into one. We knew from astronomy that the way you do this is to add them together. You average the way Hubble does when it looks at a, at a distant galaxy. It adds images together over days and days. So we wanted to average them together, and that would clean it up. But the Hubble Space Telescope is large, stable, and locked on to its target with pinpoint accuracy. The problem with this video is that the cameraman was, was moving around. He was zooming in and, and shifting the camera around. And so we had to take out all of those motions before we could add the images together. David realizes that the task is beyond existing technology. So he asked his colleagues to create new software to solve the problem. We developed a computer program, a process, for stabilizing and registering the images. Uh, it did it by taking a key frame. So we decide, all right, we want everything to match what we have in this one image in the middle. And it goes to each image and see how parts of the image are moved from one image to the next. And from that, we can figure out mathematically how the image has gotten bigger or smaller, how it's rotated, how it's shifted. They painstakingly adjust each image for size, position, and rotation to match the key image. Buried within the impenetrable shadows emerges something that looks suspiciously like a bomb. 